Hello Union, today I'm bringing you a simple and quick tip for you to perform with your handstand. This one will help you also build confidence in the handstand and help you improve the time that you can perform doing the handstand without the wall. So if you are struggling with free handstand, make sure you check this one and try to perform it in your training and it can be easily performed inside of your house. Actually, for this one, we are going to need some kind of elevated surface like the stairs or even the sofa or a bench that you can put against the wall so that it is safe and it doesn't balance too much. So in this one, you are using the bench, the sofa, just to help you support your forearm and a little bit of the arm, depending on the height of the material that you use. And with that, we are increasing the area of support of the handstand. Instead of being just your hand against the floor, now you have your hand against the floor and your forearm against the sofa or against the stair or the chair or the bench. And this means that you are going to have more area of stability and with that you are going to feel like the handstand is easier because you are having extra support in your forearm. So for this exercise, place your hands near the sofa or near the stair so that you can keep your forearm close to it and touching with the chair or the sofa. After doing that you just jump to the handstand with a controlled motion so make sure you control the motion through the handstand so that you don't fall off the balance and you lose the control during the kick up. In this one you will feel like if you balance backwards you can control it better and you won't fall as easier because you have that extra support and with that you can hold a little bit more the handstand and when it becomes easier you can progress to a smaller surface like I'm showing you here in the stairs and then you have only half of your forearm supported from the stairs and the balance will be harder again and you are being even more confident that when you get off of this position you are better prepared for performing the free standing position. This is a quick tip for you to try and experiment for yourself. It has good results, at least I used it and some other people used it and they have got some good results. And with this you have another way for you to perform the handstand and to play around the handstand so that you can improve it better and be able to perform it anywhere you want. So this was a quick tip for you guys. If you want more of this type of content, make sure to click here on my side on one of these videos and you are good to go with some extra good tips. I hope you enjoyed this one. Make sure you subscribe, share with your friends and I'm going to see you on the next one.